getting ready to do some reading, but before that I want to do a little video about uh, the mind and just how important it is to really heal it and take care of it. And what is an unhealthy mind really and what is it not? Well, first of all, we know the mind is not physical, so it can't be smacked, it can't be injured in that sense, it can't be tortured in that sense, physically. What it can be, um, you know, is, is delusional. Delusion is pain. Pain causes delusion. And delusion is like the winding up. Delusion is like the winding up. And uh, pain is like the unwinding. So when you're going through pain mentally for no apparent reason, you are actually unwinding. And delusion is what winded you up. Now, what you got to realize, and this is a big thing, is that a lot of people, they... Uh, carry throughout the day, uh, believe they get they absorb uh, lies and delusions into their minds. They make connections that aren't really there. So, for example, you know, you look at somebody and you're just walking by them and you're like, I wonder if this person likes me. Let me see if I could sense if they like me or not. And they're like, and you get this feeling. You're like, yeah, this this person really doesn't like me more than others. Um. And so, with that being said, now you believe this, but there was no connection there like that. Your mind made a connection with itself, but there was no actual reality. That person didn't dislike you. You were just, you basically lied to yourself. And uh, that, is, uh, that, is called a, that is called delusion. So when your mind makes a connection that isn't there, that's a delusion. And then eventually you will have to renounce your delusions, and they will have to unwind. And when those delusions unwind is exactly when uh, the pain will happen. So it's better to not make any delusions at all. Now, here's the trick. The trick is that your mind will automatically pick up delusions all the time, uh, whether you're aware of that or not. So whether you're aware of the fact that your mind will pick up delusions as the day goes on or not, it still will. It'll never stop picking up delusions as long as it's aware and focusing on what's around it. It'll, it'll, it'll make concepts. It'll make connections that aren't really there. But that's all conscious, and spirituality is subconscious. And spirituality is more powerful than, rather, the unconscious mind is more powerful than the conscious mind. And so the unconscious mind will seek to, rather, your soul. Let's call it mind and soul. So the mind will pick up your uh, these beliefs and the soul will seek to undo these beliefs because uh, the soul wants to remain pure and unblemished and that is really all of occult teachings and spirituality in a nutshell it's all has to do with your your mind your soul your body it has nothing to do with anyone else it has nothing to do with anything like that it's all about you know thyself 